everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, my name is Sophie, it's nice to meet you. Um, if you come back for another time, then hey, how are you? Um, in today's video, we are creating this simple, easy Halloween look. Um, I don't really do Halloween, scary Halloween. Uh, I'd much rather put on a cute lace bodysuit do a smoky eye and put on some devil horns and look cute for the night instead of looking scary and gory. So if you're like me and want to do that and want to get this cool red devil look, then uh, keep watching. Okay, so for today's Halloween look, I am recreating the makeup look that I did on Saturday um, and I was a devil. Um, so my brushes are already dirty because I literally did it. Saturday and it's Monday. So, dirty brushes. So, to begin with, we're gonna go with this beautiful palette that I got when I went to see Jeffree Star um, in the Can't Relate Tour in London, which was amazing. So we're gonna take his Blood Sugar palette, which is really has open. Look, beautiful quality, smells amazing. Hard to open. So we're going to take this palette and we're going to go into the shade Prick to start with, um, which looks a lot redder in the pan than it is when you put it on your eye. So I'm going to take Prick and then put it in the crease. it up nice and high because that's going to be our highest colour in the crease. Okay so now we've laid down the pink we're going to go back in, back in, we're going to go in with another shade from the Jeffree Star palette. We're going to go into Cherry Soda here which is this colour and this is going to go in the outer corner. And we're going to start to bring it round to the inner corner. We're going to go back in with the first brush and back into the shade Prick. Just blend that in a little bit. And then just take a fluffy blender brush and blend out all the edges. Okay, so now we've deepened up the colour a little bit. I'm going to go in with a different palette now. I'm going to go in with my Modern Renaissance palette um, from Anastasia Beverly Hills. Beverly Hills. <laughs> I'm going into the shade Red Ochre. And I'm just going to go in with a little packy brush and again right on that outside corner. Now that we've darkened up the outside corners, I'm going to wipe away the excess from underneath and I'll be back to do something else. Let's look. So I am back and I'm now going to go in with the colour Blood Sugar. This lovely sheeny red in the Blood Sugar palette. Um, on the inner corner, just giving the eyes a little something. A little something something. Um, and I am gonna wet my brush with my usual L'Oreal Infallible. Again, it's really not a necessity to wet your brushes at all. But I like to, I just feel like it stays better when I do that. So that's what I'm gonna do. Now that I've laid down that and it's slightly tacky, I'm going to go back in with the same shade on my finger. 
just to get like the most out of this color so here are the eyes so far nice red and devilish um i'm gonna pop off camera and do the rest of my face um if you want to see how i do my face just look back at uh, i have an everyday routine a few videos back um that's how i do my face every day so that's what i'm gonna do now and then i'll be back to finish off the look today i am back and i have done the majority of my face i'm just gonna finish off the eyes with you guys and then this is a simple halloween look done um so to highlight my brow bone i'm gonna go into my imagination palette and go into like my now all-time favorite highlight shade which is angel up in this top corner i have used it every day for like ages now um, so we're just gonna highlight the brow bone with this beautiful popping color I'm just gonna blend that in as well. I'm gonna go back in with three red shades that I used on my eyelids and um, to go underneath my eyes in my waterline. Um, I'm also gonna do that with a teeny tiny little brush thing. It's an eye, yeah, it's an eyebrow brush, but I like it to get right on in there underneath my lashes. So I've just gone into Prick, which was this shade here. I'm gonna take that all along the bottom. Joining it to the eyeshadow in the corner. So now that I've put that underneath the bottom lash line, I'm gonna go back in with Cherry, Sh <laughs> Cherry Soda and do that on the outer corner. And finally, going back into the Modern Renaissance palette and going into Red Ochre, do the exact same right on the outside corner, connecting the eyeshadows together. Okay, I'm gonna go in with a fluffy brush and just blend underneath. Once we've blended the under eye shadow into the upper eye shadow, we are good to go. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to go into Angel and highlight my inner corner with good old Angel. Just to make it pop more I'm gonna go in with my out for a highlight in glazed donut and go on top of that in a collar so there we have the eyes all done that's what they look like uh, I'm gonna go in with lipstick now I'm gonna take my Kylie Jenner court K lip liner and I'm just gonna line my lips with this When I say line my lips, I mean fill my lips. Now that I have lined and roughly filled my lips, I'm gonna go in with my MAC lipstick in Hang Up, which is this dark creme sheen lipstick and put that all over my lips. So there we have my finished makeup look. I'm gonna set my face, put some mascara on and be back in my costume. So here we have it. That was my simple, easy, basic Halloween look uh, with a cool red smoky eyes and dark lips. Get yourself some devil horns and you can be a devil for Halloween. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little bonus update and 
yeah, Halloween look. Um, if you enjoyed the video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as well. My name's Sophie and I would love to have you back on my channel. Thank you very much for watching.